All right, let me get my little mouse ready. See it? All right, that is the switch. This is the uh, glow plug signal right over here. That's 19, 17, AC, and 30. And the 50, you just follow a little line right straight up. It goes on the opposite side of the safety relay over here, W2. And then the other side of the safety relay comes down and hooks to 17, which, you know, uh. <laughs> so actually all that should be hooked to 17 right now is the um, glow plugs, uh, the signal, and well, we ain't got that anymore, so we'll have to figure something out. The main thing is is get these two right here right because you turn the switch backwards okay and then I'll have to trace it all out because uh, this thing comes all the way over it goes up to the fuse box and then the fuse box uh, a lot of these things aren't ah, aren't on here like I don't have a fuel meter I no longer have a thermostat I got a manual and then a fuel sensor we don't have that we don't have a thermo sensor it doesn't have a, these this is for like two different models or, uh, or three different models the 1710 the 1700 and uh, right up here it tells you you know but uh, the 1910 they, they all cross over with almost the same wire and harness so my main concern is See, I don't, my tack is over where I need to get that wired in, right? That's for sure. And that'll come up through here. But my main concern is this right here. Yep. See. <sighs> Heat. <laughs> Starter switch circuits. Heat off on start. Off high and low for lighting circuits. We don't have lights. So, uh... Let's go out there and put it on 17 and 19. We know 30 is correct. And we'll move the glow plug over to 17. And we'll try to find out what's all hooked on that thing. We don't need all that on there. It's got to be hooked up right. It'll work, I hope, anyway. But uh, the AC, which is uh, the electric, you know, it hooks generally to everything right here. You see it? So it would actually come up and the alternator, the battery, that's probably why the uh, uh, little lights on on the on tack is showing that it's not charging. And I don't have pressure oil pressure sending unit. I'm going to put a manual in there by the way. So there you go guys. Now we just uh, go out there and figure it out. Peace. Trial and error.